everyone this is anamika and welcome to my channel wingzo bio in this video we will understand the difference between holophytic and holozoic nutrition holophytic nutrition is also called photosynthetic nutrition okay so let's get started holophytic nutrition holophytic nutrition is found in green plants and some bacteria most of the green plants have holophytic nutritions examples mango amla neem maples tulsi okay and some bacteria also for example cyanobacteria blue green algae also have a holophytic nutritions they synthesize their own food holozoic nutrition holozoic nutrition is found in animals most of the animals and some protozoan protist what is protozoan protist protozoan means first animals protozoan protist is a single celled animals which have a very defined nucleus okay again i am repeating protozoan protist is a single celled eukaryotic animals which have very defined nucleus for example amoeba paramecium euglena trypnosoma etc so all have a holozoic nutritions they depend on other organisms for their nutrition only inorganic raw materials are taken from outside in the holophytic nutrition what kind of inorganic raw materials are used the first one is carbon dioxide water sunlight chlorophyll and these are the inorganic materials which are needed to synthesize their own food in holozoic nutrition ready made food of organic materials are taken from outside organic materials means the food which is synthesized by the plant which is a very simple form of carbohydrate that is sugar and that is used by the holozoic organisms okay and that is organic material so in holozoic nutrition ready made food of organic materials are taken from outside they don't synthesize their own food they take the ready made food from the outside in holophytic nutrition is a absorptive type of nutrition holophytic nutrition is a absorptive type of nutrition means they absorb the sunlight through chlorophyll okay and in holozoic nutrition holozoic nutrition is a ingestive type of nutrition what is ingestive ingestive means food is taken into the mouth okay and here in holophytic they absorb the sunlight through chlorophyll and here the food is taken into the mouth in holophytic nutrition organic food is self manufactured they manufacture their own food and what is organic food as i told you that that is carbohydrate simple carbohydrate that is sugar in holozoic nutrition organic food is taken from outside they don't manufacture their own food they take the food from the outside in holophytic nutrition chlorophyll is present for trapping light energy chlorophyll is very needed for trapping light energy the plants who haven't chlorophyll those who are not green in color they can't make their own food okay and in holozoic chlorophyll is absent in holophytic nutrition sunlight is essential for this type of nutrition why because sunlight only absorb the excuse me only chlorophyll absorb the sunlight and which is very needed to synthesize their food and in holozoic nutrition 
sunlight has no role for this type of nutrition okay in holophytic nutrition examples are grass mango wheat sunflower tulsi maples many green plants are the examples of holophytic nutrition and here holozoic nutrition humans we are the humans we also have a new holozoic nutrition deer lion cockroach etc if you like my video please hit the like button and subscribe my channel thank you have a nice day